Okay, great. There's what a house, house burning down. It's the laundry. There's a house. Yo, Dimitri here. Welcome to another episode. Um, I don't know why I constantly do this with my hands, but join me for the ride. Welcome back to another episode of The Local. Uh, Dimitri here. Um, thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, really means a lot. Today we're going to, known as pizza in Astoria, Queens, um, we're actually going to make a pie, one of the known as pies with owner Leon. Um, known as a special because they make everything from scratch. The dough, the meatballs, um, the fresh mozzarella, everything's made from scratch. Um, we're gonna get to see how everything is made. I'm really excited about this. Um, Leon is actually from Astoria. He grew up in Astoria. He worked with his parents um, in their deli. So that's where he kind of learned all of his, you know, all of the importance of ingredients and making everything from scratch. And I believe even the olive oil that they use on all the pies um, is actually from Crete. You know, they import it from Crete. So um, I think you guys are going to really enjoy Leon and his team. Uh, let's get into it. Uh, my father came from Cyprus. We opened up that deli. Um, the deli owned deli. Right by NYU on Broadway and Waverly Street. Been there for 40 years. Uh, he just closed it like five, six years ago. The rent skyrocketed for like 60 grand a month. So that's when I first got into the kitchen. Um, and that's where uh, I got interested in making sauce and meatballs and all the good stuff that came with the deli as a little kid. And that place was open for 40 years? 40 years, yeah. So, so does it have, yeah, I was going to say, does it have to like, uh, do we have to like pinch it towards the sides so it can come up a little bit or no? Well, we don't want too much crust, so we don't go crazy on the sides, you know okay. what I'm saying? We want just a little bit, just like that. And this, you can pull it, we like it to be square, okay. you know? Now, round two. Take some a little bit of this is garlic and olive oil. Olive oil is from uh, Greece. Yep. Imported from the island Greece. Round two. Is that a good coat of garlic? Yeah, that's good. A little dab. Right, Light. Yep. Well, what cheese is this? That one is uh, Pecorino Romano. Sprinkle it on. Okay. okay. Now we take a little shredded, shredded mozzarella. Just, these two are the same cheeses, but we layer it on the bottom to make sure every bite gets a little cheese. I like 
like for a little extra cheese. Yeah, so go for it. Put a little more. The main cheese is right here. This is the mushroom. Put on. Okay, crush it. How am I doing? Ah. So, usually we put lines of sauce. So, for you to be easier, we're going to put it in the front. Usually, we do it with them. Um, everybody does it a little bit different. So, you're going to do lines. So, do like okay. uh, about an you inch? You start off there and then you just keep going. Yeah, about an inch. And you go on like, you go on down. Can't be too much, but it can't be too little. Everything matters when you're making it. I was gonna say, is this an art or a science? Both. There we go. Pretty good. Right. Now you take the cheese and you put it in between. In between. Long line. That's the cheese we stretch and make it ourselves. At the commissary, yep. right? It used to be here, now it's at the commissary. So this, so this is your first location in Queens? Or yes, is, yep. is the, this is the see. first location after the city? After the city. Oh, yeah. If you had the chance to name some of Leon's pies, what would you name them, Dimitri? Um, so I have a few. I want to. I want. Yeah, I have, I have a few. I want to. Uh, maybe in the future, we can come up with names of pies together, <laughs> based on rock rock stars and rock music. So if we do a meat one, can we do a meatwood mac? Of course we can. Meatwood mac. <laughs> Definitely. Instead of cheesy next, we can do cheesy, cheesy next. Instead of Stevie next. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good one too. Now throw it in the oven. All right, here we go. Looks nice. Put it on top. All right. Deep. How was how was that for a first first time? Oh, right. Evil pie. Okay? That was a uh, Eva. 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 With, with a, a buffalo chicken. Yeah, buffalo chicken go over. Alright, I'm gonna finish it off with blue cheese and hot sauce and it's like a buffalo sauce, buffalo chicken. Yeah. Yeah. No tango. Pull ah. it out a little bit. Oh, okay. Oh, this is good. Nice. Put that in the box. I think it's good. Ready to go? Yeah. You're ready. Put it right in. You got it. Awesome. Nice pie. Looks delicious. Now you got a home. Yeah, perfect. Check out that crust. Beautiful. <laughs> now you're gonna have to Don't be shy, we love this. Right. I mean, I know Liam for back in the day, you know, about 30 years, 40 years. Uh, it's from the day, but I just, uh, I was a, uh, I transposed it to a story. I came from the Greenwich Village. So, you know, I mean, I had a pizza background. My, my, my uncle owned the Amalfi Pizza on Bleecker Street. And just one of those things. Good food. You know, I seem to find good food wherever I go. Is that why you came back to Astoria? I came to Astoria, my parents split up. And my mother moved to Astoria. And I thought this was the country. I was like, compared to Bleecker Street. Yeah, I go, this is crazy right here. I go, this is, there's no buildings. I need a car. You need a car? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, but I support Leon because he's got quality product. But it's 
that's true. And you know, we, he came. That's my way of spreading the word. Just feeding people. Yeah. Oh, that's <laughs> it. I'm sorry. I'm walking away from like. I'm like, oh, 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 oh. Okay. Um, owner Leon is actually from Astoria. He is a native. Uh, he opened up his 1977 pizza, and uh, he. he 